if this was a real hack attack, what we basically will be looking for. E-commerce business insurance covers the cost of sending computer consultants to your company to stop the hack attack. We want to do a port scan on the system. Well, most hackers use known software vulnerabilities to break into systems. And once they're in, they can steal money or goods, modify or destroy data or software, or even bring a network down entirely. Can we pull up a web page just to see if that works? The policies cover loss of income for the time a site is down and unable to make sales. If your site provides content only, you'll be reimbursed for lost click-throughs, which are used to determine ad revenues. Back when I was a hacker, you could determine that uh, trying to break into to, to one site might be very easy to do. In some instances, it, it, it might be difficult to tell. The Insurance Information Institute says that since hackers will try to reprogram your computer to help their scheme to overload a site, there are steps you can take to avoid becoming an unwilling accomplice. And some of these include make sure your antivirus program is up to date to keep destructive programs off your computer, use a hard to guess password and change it frequently, and install a software firewall to inspect internet traffic coming into your computer. And if you're an open computer and they can find a vulnerability, then they will break in. Firewalls are critical to the business function. As businesses pour thousands of dollars into making their websites work and produce income, they'll likely find their risk from a hack attack will grow too. Carolyn Gorman reporting.